Hello, welcome everyone, welcome to our course. This will be a brief introduction to the course. First off, let's start with meeting the host, who is me. Hello, I'm Mark from BitNinja, uh, I'm a product manager and I've been working with BitNinja for over two years. I'm a fan of anything that is technology related, um, computers, IT, anything IT related basically, um, AI, security, servers, um, drones even. Um, anything that lights up <laughs> also fascinates me. Um, so yeah, and I just I just love um, to teach and to educate people. So I really hope you will enjoy this course by me. And just a brief introduction to the course is um, this course we will cover the ins and outs of BitNinja and server security in general. So you can be prepared against the hackers um, when they come for your machine eventually. And also to walk you through the uh, trial and installation, the registration process. And we will also set up a test environment. So if you don't have any servers ready to go, don't worry. We will uh, cover this form for you. And you will be able to uh, follow the course steps on this virtual machine. So fear not. And just uh, what BitNinja really is, um, it's just a short, really short introduction. And um, basically BitNinja is a multi-layered server security solution. And we protect your machines and servers on every front, um, be it direct attack uh, to one of the hosted websites or a port scanning on your machines, um, or DOS attacks, de uh, denial of service attacks. Um, and BitNinja will be there to to stop it for you. Basically, with our community-based IP reputation lists um, and attack intelligence, we are able to grant the machines within our system a so-called herd immunity. And we also prefer a proactive approach to security rather than the reactive, um, which we will cover later on in this course. So don't want to go too deep into the uh, how-tos on the, on the first uh, slide. So hang on there. And just a little bit of history on, on who, who we are really is we basically started out as a, uh, as a hosting company in the hosting industry and operating one of the major hosting providers in the country. And however, the hackers were relentless, um, which we have uh, had basically many sleepless nights because of them, because uh, constant just hijacking and uh, infecting of our machines um, and that time um, which is in the early to be 2000s 2010 ish um, even though there were some siloed products um, that have existed already they have never really provided the full protection um, or at least not uh, on, on the software level so they also require a lot of fine-tuning in order to not produce false positives and also the handling of these false positives have been a nightmare. So one day we basically decided to just do something about it for ourselves and that's how we started to work at BitNinja. Um, and a little fun fact, it was not called um, BitNinja. Back then it was actually called Heimdall. Um, so, but our other company already beat us to the punch and um, they've had this name, so we became BitNinja. But the fun fact is that you can still see some of the remnants of this as some of our IP um, sets and lists are, are still called Heimdall, Dash, Greylist, for example. Um, and then after uh, testing and, uh, and everything internally, uh, we've already had hundreds of subscribers to our beta product. And so we started to basically roll out the, the beta version to, to the masses and the feedback was overwhelmingly positive both from beta testers and from our team as well and well then everything <laughs> since then is basically just history as um, we, we grew and grew and grew and realized that there is a huge potential in BitNinja because um, it have helped us, so it can help others as well. So why do we do it is our motto is to make the internet a safer place together. 
and we really hope and we, we really imagine a world where server owners can focus on what matters um, without worrying for their business getting targeted by hackers and you, you sitting here are an integral part of this vision because we couldn't do it without you um, so thank you for uh, for being here and thank you for for uh, showing interest in bit ninja and so let's begin the course um, in in order to follow this uh, we will need a few things uh, for example putty um, or your preferred way to SSH into a server this is completely up to you we will use putty and you will see me use it um, but you don't have to use if you prefer another solution um, you will also need the server so you will be able to find a download link uh, to a virtual machine already set up and ready to go you will just have to uh, pop it into virtual box and you will be able to use it or if you already have a VPS or any test machine set up you can use that so um, there's no no hard limits on what you can use or what you can't it just has to be one of the supported operating systems um, Ubuntu, CentOS um, or, or whatever basically that, that we support and also you will need the BitNinja account of course um, which we will register um, in, in the uh, course so you will be able to follow the, the steps with me so don't worry about that so hope to see you on the next lesson and let's begin